This is code.org. Let's see what we have here. A nice benefit of using functions to remove repeated code is that you can now easily make changes to multiple places in your code. That's true. Just change how you create the function. And your program will now use the new code everywhere your function is called. Okay, some reminders. A function call is when we ask it to run. So right here is set flyer. That's the name of a function. I can tell it's in a green block. Now, when the computer hits this, right, first it makes a flyer, it sets the image to the flyer, and then it says, set flyer, what the heck is that? Mm -hmm. Smack. Oh, it's this block of code. It's like a box of code. And it says, okay, I need to run this. Sets the X, changes the Y, gives it a velocity, and it hits the bottom. Once it hits the bottom here, it doesn't just go down at all. It goes and says, okay, well, where did this start? Oh, yeah, up here. Okay, well, I'm done with that. And it drops the next line. It would then hit the draw loop. The draw loop is the only function that runs automatically. And so it will run 30 times a second. And that's what occurs. Make changes to the set flyer function so that the start at a random Y location 0, 400 and moves velocity every time. So what we did last time, oh, and it for some reason doesn't look like it saved. We did set flyer here. And what that does is if the flyer's X location is less than 50, it will just loop back around. All right, make changes set flyer function. So the flyer starts at a random Y location between zero and 400. Oh, okay. And so normally to make a change like this, we would have to go wherever we were unset flyer and put randomize Y, randomize Y up here, right? But instead, since we're running set flyer here and here, we just go to the function and run that code. So if we want to randomize Y every time we put the player, the flyer back over here, well, we only have to do it once. We can do it inside of this set flyer, set flyer function instead of everywhere we actually are using set flyer. It can just go inside of this block and it will run every time. So they already have flyer.y and I think what they asked for, zero to 400, great. So I'm gonna grab random, I'm gonna do, whoop, not there, I want it there. And I'm gonna do zero to 400, I believe, is what they're saying, and let's hit run. Oh, this is gonna drive me nuts how slow it is. Let's speed that guy up, just for this demo. I don't know if they even want you to do this, but I'm doing it. And so notice, even when I hit run, it starts at a random location. So now it's way down here, way up here. And every time that flyer is asked to run, right when we start, it will randomize the Y location. And then each time it gets past negative 50 and respawns. Pretty cool. Onward.